Hello, world. Tis I, Andrew, the bearded lady from Hairy Game Lords, and I thought I would unbox this bad boy that I got through the post today off of Kickstarter. Good times. So, here we go. Planetoid. It's a nice, heavy box. A uh, little bit of the blurb on the back. Basically, it's a, it, you're trying to find uh, different resources on this kind of planet board. Looked pretty cool. It's from Portal Games. Takes, well, it takes 30 minutes to play for one to four players. That's right. You can be a Billy No Mates and play this game on your own. Great stuff. Right. Let's uh, strip. <laughs> Strip off the um, cellophane, good times, and then let's get inside this. Boom, straight up, nice, uh, thick box like that. Wow, who needs inserts? Eh, look at all this, right? Well, there's quite a uh, nice looking rule book here. Let's have a look inside. Okay, wow, loads and loads of stuff to have a look through great stuff looks kind of arty like that oh some white pages marvelous for additional and advanced rules great okay well there we go something to peruse we have a paper score pad by the looks of things there we go very nice Got some cards here. I like the kind of I like the artwork on this. Uh, let's just see what the quality of these cards are like. Oh my days! Cellophane on that is ridiculously difficult. Let me pulled my dentures. <laughs> I mean my teeth out. He's still struggling. There we go. Okay, so the they've got a kind of a matte finish, the cards. Not drastically thick, but uh, they'll do. They'll do. And we've got that whole kind of new cards feeling where they've, they're all kind of stuck together. Great stuff. Right, well, these will make more sense when I have perused the, the said rules. Right, so we've got some cards there. They've given you some, uh, some baggies. Very nice. For... Uh, Hopefully things once they've been punched. Ooh, there's a cloth sack. A magique with planetoid. Nice on that on there. Very nice. Let's have a look at this. Right, I believe that this is effectively the player board. Opening it up. Ooh. I like how they've done this, actually. So, yes, here we have uh, the player board. Look at that, the way there's a... Uh, it's kind of like dual layered there. Uh, let's just move this out for a moment. So I'm guessing this kind of goes on like this, and then these, there's something that kind of clips around the outside, like so. Can you see what's happening here? Wonderful. Like that, to form a large planetoid thing. So we've got uh, stuff going on here like that. That's all. Say like that's all clipped in together. What else is in this box? Ooh, I wonder what I've just done there. Wow, these are very thick and very kind of chunky. I'm guessing these are kind of different uh, things there. So they're double sided. These are kind of like your player boards. Really like the feel of this. Nice. It just feels really good quality. I like the kind of like the artwork on there as well. So there's a kind of indentation things that you can place things within, I'm guessing, uh, to do different things as you are mining the planet oid. Brilliant. Great. So there's ofs four of these player boards because it is for up to four players. And then let's just have a look at all of this in here. Loads and loads of boards to Loads and loads of stuff to punch there. Again, just look at the thickness of that player board. 
that punch board stuff. So here are different uh, things that will go places. Ah, here we go. So you see this? See what they've done there? So that all of these round circle things here are all the different things that you will discover on the planet. Nice. You see what I did there? Brilliant. So uh, there's some gold on this one. There's some, ooh, some like gems. Nice. Uh, and some other interesting and wonderful things. And they all, all of those things go face down. They're all shuffled up and they go face down on there. Uh, and so you can then do some actual mining. Now, one thing that I really like on this, and this was a little bit of a concern of mine, and that was um, how often you'd be able to play this game without these punch boards getting a little bit kind of like raggedy around the edge. Now, you can see that it's a really good quality punch board there, so uh, that's cool. But what I have just noticed is, so all of the this kind of dual... Uh, the double kind of like thickness of this board and then these lines here help you to not only put it in nicely and actually it's a little bit bigger than needed so that it's not going to get worn but it helps you just to push down and, and get the thing out. Brilliant. So my fears have been eased. I think that we'll be able to play this game over and over often without the this getting kind of like worn and knackered brilliant excellent stuff so loads of stuff to get punching here brilliant stuff uh, looks like to be this kind of like a little spaceship these look like some other little kind of like alien spaceship tings oh look at that they're kind of they're double-sided blue on that side and pink on that side wonderful great well i'm gonna punch all of this and enjoy doing so might even get me at me a five-year-old daughter involved because she likes to do some punching of the boards. Great stuff. This is Planetoid. Uh, watch out for a hairy Game Lord review of this coming soon. Thank you all for watching. Later. Bye.